Charges could soon be filed against the Seattle woman allegedly behind the Capital One data breach. According to new court documents, the servers seized from Paige Thompson's Beacon Hill home on July 29th not only included data stolen from Capital One, but also data from more than 30 other companies, educational institutions, even other entities. Investigators are still working to determine the type of data that was stolen, but say much of it does not appear to contain personal identifying information. According to new court documents, the government plans to file an additional charge against Thompson once the victims are identified. Thompson is scheduled to appear in a Seattle courtroom tomorrow for a hearing.